time with Elena. Story time with Elena. Stay away from strangers, by Diane Pappas and Richard Covey. Today is the youth soccer championships. The Red Tornadoes are playing in the semifinals. Okay, team. We have an hour before our game starts. Let's take some time to warm up," said Coach Johnson. Great shot, Nancy! Coach Johnson yelled. Why don't we rest now before the game? I'll be right back. I need to speak to the referees. Hey, let's play hide and seek until the game starts," said Nancy. Nancy will never find me here," thought Rita excitedly. Rita looked up to see a woman coming toward her. She was carrying a leash and seemed to be looking for something. Have you seen a puppy running around here? The woman asked Rita. My puppy is missing. Meanwhile, at the Kid Guardian headquarters, let's go, Carrot. Zack urged. That woman is using the lost puppy trick. Stop, Rita! Ordered Zack. Never go anywhere with a stranger. Just walk away. My name is Carrot, and this is Zack," said Carrot. "Our job is to make sure that kids stay safe. Zack is going to explain to you three important rules about strangers." Coach Johnson came to join them. He was glad that Zack and Carrot had come to help. The first rule is. You should never go anywhere with a stranger," Zack said. "The second rule is: don't take anything from a stranger. No candy, no toys, no money, nothing." The third rule, explained Carrot, is never let a stranger hold or touch you. Stay at least five steps away, and always remember. Continued Zack, an adult you do not know should never ask you for help. If this happens, just leave and tell your parents or a safe adult. Okay, kids, the referee is calling our team. Let's go out on the field," called Coach Johnson. "We've done our job here," Carrot said. Zack, it's time to get back to Kid Guardian headquarters. Let's remember the stranger danger rules we learned today. Number one, don't go anywhere with a stranger. Number two, don't take anything from a stranger. Number three, never let a stranger touch you. Just walk away. The end.